Hi, I want to make a message for Brian Denlinger here, or anybody who's listening. <clears throat> this is about a short video that Brian Denlinger uploaded yesterday, and he's since deleted. It was titled, Edward Fen Feniger <laughs> Facing Legal Action for Harassment. And so here he's threatening to take legal action against Ed Feniger. Feniger. Well, Brian Denlinger, I want you to open your King James Bible, and I want you to go to 1 Corinthians chapter 6. Okay, and let's look at First Corinthians chapter six, verse six. It says, "But brother goeth to law with brother, and that before the unbelievers. Now therefore there is utterly a fault among you, because ye go to law one with another. Why do ye not rather take wrong? Why do ye not rather suffer yourselves to be defrauded?" So I'm asking you that, Brian Denlinger. Why do ye rather not suffer yourself to be defrauded? Why would you try to take Ed Finiger to court, or to threaten legal action against him, if you're a King James Bible believer. I'm reading from the King James Bible. He's saying that you are fault at fault for taking a brother to court. And, he's, and Brian Denlinger may say, well, Ed Finiger, he's not a brother. Well then, Brian Denlinger, I want you to open your King James Bible to Matthew chapter 5. Okay, let's go to Matthew chapter 5. And let's see here. <clears throat> How about Matthew chapter 5, verse 38? Ye have heard that it hath been said, an eye for an eye, and a tooth for a tooth. But I say unto you that ye resist not evil, but whosoever shall smite thee on thy right cheek, turn to him the other also. And if any man will sue thee at the law, and take away thy coat, let him have thy cloak also. And whosoever shall compel thee to go a mile, go with him twain. Give to him that asketh thee, and from him that would borrow of thee, turn not thou away. Ye have heard that it hath been said, Thou shalt love thy neighbor, and hate thine enemy. But I say unto you, Brian Denlinger, Love your enemies, bless them that curse you, do good to them that hate you, and pray for them which despitefully use you and persecute you. Now did Jesus say to threaten legal action against them? Or to bless them that curse you, do good to them that hate you, and to pray for them which despitefully use you and persecute you? Brian Denlinger, you have been rebuked by the King James Bible. God bless.